Hello YouTube and welcome back into some Let's Play Civilization 6 where the war continues. The war continues. Too many gen I need I, I need to retire them or like just get them out of my way. Couple more bombards come in. Great Gonzo, thank you so much for the four months of that prime sub. Welcome on back. Value for value, thank you, friend. I appreciate that. Here, have some value. Take it. Someone should have it. <laughs> I will gladly have your Prime sub, and thank you very kindly for it. Much, much appreciated, Gonzo. And welcome on back. All right, let's see where we can go here. <laughs> they shouldn't be allowed to build walls if I have... If I have uh, recently attacked their city. Because that's ridiculous. I'm going to see if we can kind of get down and do the same thing over here. While our muskets and other such units start to work their way up front. Because it's, I mean, look at these attacks now. They're miserable. It doesn't do anything. Be able to punch through that little health. I don't. I don't agree with that. Especially with a haboob raging. Yeah, I think I think I'm, I'll be able to punch through with muskets, but I don't think I'm doing it with um, with these coursers. So next turn we get some uh, unit upgrades in. Oh, whoops! I meant to meant to repair that. Now, I could sit here and keep the city sieged, but I don't know that I'm going to. Yeah, Dan I was just thinking that, Daniel. Same page club. Why not win the city? Because they got walls. So they got walls, and cavalry have a, a pretty severe disadvantage. When attacking walls, I can try to get something going. Um, but so since they instantly got walls, all of my attacks now do nothing. So I'd rather take these units that are bad at attacking walls and try to like try to one turn one of these cities, um, or maybe be able to at least get there without them building walls super fast. While I while I bring down muskets um, and and other things that are actually effective at getting walls. Yeah, we can try to get some of these better roads online. I don't know that it'll happen. We'll see. But note that that city is going to heal up because I'm not keeping it sieged. So it's kind of a mess down here. Tokyo would be a good target. I don't want to kill this vampire. If we kill it, it goes back here and we'll wind up being more useful in the fight. Oh, 
All right, let's put in some policies for upgrades, money, and resources. Don't need this. Probably need, we need some gold. Our gold's real bad now. So probably bringing in Mer Merchant Confederation works. And this will get better soon. I think we can actually keep our policies going. Um, one of our main targets to get stronger is nationalism. And that is over here in the civics tree. Not to mention we have some decent theater squares. Um, not really, like, the, de the deity AI kind of cheats, which is why they, like, insta-got walls there. Um, and so I'm just trying to make the best use of these units. That's his vampire. All right. So we've got units that are ready to be upgraded. We should also see if we can trade with our ally. I use the term ally in air quotes. 18 gold per turn is decent, though. We'll take it. We'll gladly take that. Oh, that was... Hmm. Okay. Slow moving. This road to Kumasi could be very good. It goes right by Matterhorn. But boy, I, I think our army is going to be right here, right? So, so if I can try to do this, and frankly, we're not going to be fighting Scotland for a while. I think I can get away with this. Yeah, we can do both. Although this is fine too, because that'll reset when we're finally there. I, I think I, I think that's okay. Got to be careful of these vamps a bit. So no attack there. If this samurai wants to step out and grab this, that's fine with me. We've got muskets coming. So no, no more reinforcing from the back line. If we're going to get any more units, we're going to either buy them or build them on the front line. Uh, we can buy them with faith now. Yeah, I think this, this road that we just asked for is going to go to here, right? Pretty much. Keep in mind they're fighting. So she has multiple things to deal with. We'll do that. We get some era score. Flip them back. I don't want to fight them. Rip my uh, scout unit. So he did indeed uh, step outside to try to grab their builder back. That may be good for us. We have the movement here now.
I'm not scared of this vampire. I just want to bring my vampires up. Barb camp. That's pretty annoying. Maybe candy will help us with it. My trade route. I mean, yeah, I can I can get another one. There are walls here now. So our only chance to kind of snipe a city is going to be right here. ignore this camp well I've got Victor here yeah okay I'll deal with the camp then <laughs> uh, advice advise us on how I'm doing uh, as honesty and my privacy allows uh, Sturm, what, in what way? I'm doing a lot of different ways in a lot of different ways. Uh, <laughs> what, can you narrow that down? Do you mean me as a person? Do you mean me as a human being? Do you mean me as a content creator? Do you mean me as a, as a, as a, as a, as a dork? As a, as a, as an idiot? <laughs> I'm gonna work some science here now. Can you narrow that down? And I, I, I'd be glad to talk about anything. Not really. It's up to me. Um, I think my advice then would be stick around and hang out for the chat we're about to have with Bozdius. Because uh, we're going to talk about a lot of things like that and a lot of how we're doing and, and uh, talk about content creation a bit. Talk about life on the internet. Things like that. So if you hang out for till the end of this video, we're going to jump on with Boz in a little bit. And it's going to be great. I'm excited. Thank you. Thanks for sticking around. Thanks for being interested. I love that. More governor titles, not really what we need, but that's all right. No walls here. So we finally get a city. But we do finally take out one of these cities. We can maybe skew up to Tokyo or kind of just, oh. <laughs> I think I said to begin the day, like, getting through this mountain range is going to be a challenge. And you can see that, indeed, it is going to be a challenge. <laughs> this thing is going for my trade route, and I think that's fine. As long as it's not pestering me, we can get those. How far from mountain tunnels? Too far. Too far for sure. Uh. <laughs> okay. Whatevs. Um, one thing that we can do here that is going to be fairly valuable, I think, is buy another siege tower. Having a couple of these going around will be good. And since now we're on the front line, that's fine. Uh, and we can bring in Reyna. Or whoever this is, Reyna. Uh, Pinkasaurus Rex, thanks for the follow. Welcome in.
Once this army is here, we should be fine. This is a city that we could absolutely raise and not feel super bad about it, but it does have a campus. It's not going to be ours for very long here uh, until we can take some more cities. So there's certainly an argument to raise it. Oh, we do have a great general that can convert. That's not a bad idea. Where is that one? Forms a core out of a land unit. That's not bad. I must have brought up that general. There's the art of war. This gives us a promotion. I don't want that on any of these units. I don't know where that general went. Maybe it's El Cid. I don't want to keep spending my money on like buying tiles and stuff. Actually, we should be running uh, commercial hub grants because we need money. If we're going to keep upgrading our army and keep uh, improving what we're doing, we're going to need money. That's one of our major deficiencies and tends to be later on in domination games. Uh, despite your abundance of trade routes, there are very few people to trade with. All right. He's got a back facing encampment. That's good to know. happy to pillage that. Guess I could use that for this one. I probably should. Amy! Today is for Amy. Amy, thank you so much. Happy Welcome back. Happy 10th men's anniversary. It's so good. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Welcome back for 10 months. Thank you so much for being a tier 3 sub. I love that. Thank you very, very much. How are you? It's good to see you. Good to have you here today. I am doing I am doing very well. Thank you for asking. I'm doing very well. Don't know how walls work? What do you need to know about walls, Vinny? Uh, when I, okay, when I have to bring, it seems like the blue bar takes forever, the first strikes. Um, it depends what you're, so, so when you're trying to take down walls, you should be using either battering rams or siege towers. Battering rams will help take down the walls faster. Siege towers ignore the walls and go right for the city strength. So use this, um, they don't work with cavalry units at all. So use, use those with melee units only. Um, and if that's not, and if those aren't working, you, you need siege units like these bombards. And that will also take down walls and things like that. There we go. I can't get this back home super quick. Probably lose a couple more uh, light calf here at some point. It'll be okay. Seventeen pop cap. That's uh, pretty hefty.
I think I will we'll just wait for the siege tower, keep our army healthy. It's on its way. One. I mean, we might as well try to bring it out. Can get up in here and pillage some stuff, maybe. We're opening ourselves up to a lot of attacks. Um, let's get some scouting done over here. It's the weirdest commercial hub I've ever built. But I want trade. We need money. Could go after harbors. I think I'll just build their commercial hub now, finally. Nice. Our culture's looking quite good. I want these online. I know. How is Oracle still here? <laughs> that I can't explain. Okay, so that was the loss of that one. Whatever is contrary. These vampires up here, finally. There go the walls. All right, we are making progress here. Enlightenment, mercantilism, nationalism. Let's just go right for nationalism now. I don't even need this Boudicca. Oh, we have barbs up here we could go grab. That could be okay. All right, next turn, these cities are going to start to fall. Maybe this turn? This turn, cities are going to start to fall. Siege Tower is almost up. We have a Bombard here nearby as well. I haven't built my unique unit or my unique tile improvement. Because I'm just like that. Does the samurai icon look like a turtle? <laughs> I don't see any samurai now. I can't. I don't know. To me to do that. Berger, thank you so much for the nine months. Welcome on back, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's go get up in these cities' faces. We want to take them quickly. Don't, I'm not ready to mess with this city, really. Too much going on there. Uh, we had pillaged already, Kit. I don't think I had enough movement to pillage twice in a turn. I could be wrong. I didn't notice it, frankly. I did. Okay. 
I believes you. All right, so do we just go right for the cap and ignore this city? Or is it going to be worth our time to come down here? I think we can ignore it. I want to uh, section off the vampire and make room for our muskets. Tin Kyoto, Kyoto fixes our loyalty issues. Yeah, I, I tend to agree. That's where we're headed. Don't want anything here, really. Can and should you settle on a ley line? Yes. Settling on ley lines is great. Um, that you'll still get the adjacency bonus. And you can just build your like your normal your normal setup, which is like districts next to your cap or next to your cities. Uh, and you'll get that bonus. And then later on, you'll still get the full yields when it's time to get those. One time deal. I, I'm gonna pass on that one. Sweet, sweet offer though. All right, and that brings us into a new era. Plenty of era score that time around. We do have Lady Six Guy and Hojo in regular eras, so our loyalty is certainly worse than it was a turn ago. We're about to lose this city. Uh, that's all right, frankly. This is classic medieval, and we can give a promo out. I think we'll we'll do that with our bombard. I can't shoot you because I don't have the movement. Close. Can we shoot with the bombard now? Oh, we can. That seemed like a good attack. Thanks, Yola. Thank you, thank you. I really don't even want to tangle with the vamps, kind of knowing what they do, right? There's a route we want.
This flips, I think. Yep. So loyalty should be stabilized, even though we just lost that that city. It shouldn't be too hard to reclaim it. There we go. Stable. Does this look like a turtle? A little. Looks a little like a turtle. Oh my goodness. That's funny. See, we didn't lose any districts here, right? So, like, pillaging districts can be can feel pretty bad. The, the econ's good. And if you're not in a war that, like, needs to keep going, then it's good. I do need to check in and make sure we're not going to, like, lose a uh, religious victory here. We're not. Should be fine. Two-turn oracle. Oracle by the sea. Two turn rebellion here. So I think we will need to take all of these cities if we have, want to have a shot to hold all this stuff. So let's um let's take down these walls. Uh Relegatus, thank you so much for the uh, repeat prime sub. Welcome on back. Thank you very much. It's good to have you here. So where does that go then? Here, I think? Oh no, it went all the way back there. Meh. Get some more gold out of this now. Muskets versus Coursers is not great, but keep in mind that they do not have the deity bonus of four. So it's not as bad. Ouchies. Ouchies, that hurt. The lowest. Oh, that's right. I forgot that we had a scout sitting here almost forever. <laughs> How does the Diplo Quarter change city states? City so city states used to give you all the bonuses. Um to to like uh so so, so first of all, the yields have been nerfed in in some situations. This used to be four. Uh, and now we get it in the banks, shipyards, and consulate, and stock exchange, seaports, and chancery. So the, the consulate and the chancery are the new Diplo Quarter uh, districts. And if you have a lot of city-states in the games, it's quite good. Um, this is still good and, frankly, goes up to the third tier of units. just takes a little bit longer to get there. Um, I actually like the Diplo changes to city-states. I'm pro. Is it true that pillaging tiles and or districts weakens the city's defense? Yes. Yeah. Sure is. More great people. Free traders. Nice.
Okay. start to bring this siege tower over yonder. While we take out these last couple cities. They're falling fairly quickly. take the yields of that. We definitely need the gold. I sprang upon the swift ship in the form of a dolphin. Pray to me as Apollo Delphinius. Also the altar itself shall be called Delphinius and overlooked forever. Is there a lot or any merit to taking cities, uh, city states during a dom, dom game? Yeah, for sure. Uh, if they're strategically located or you don't need their suzerain bonuses, um, or just to kind of get you going in, in like the, there was a, there was a phase in this game where we kind of had an army sitting there for a while and we could have certainly like taken out candy, like just to give them something to do while we, while we tech and, and, and cinch up our timings and stuff. Um, so there are plenty of reasons to take city states in dom games. Uh, but you want to want to do so carefully, responsibly. You don't just want to blindly take them willy nilly. All right, what do we want now? I'm gonna run a couple theater square fests just to get our culture. Um, actually, we're right. We're right at nationalism. I guess armies matter. I don't really know what to run. I don't know what to build here. I guess this is fine. Fine-ish. <laughs> We're almost done with the video, Major Bank Geek. Almost done. And then we will jump on with your daddy. <laughs> we do have a couple vampires castles out. Uh, we have... Well, we have a broken one, but it seems like our cap is still benefiting from it. Um, but we have this one, which is uh, 12 food, 22 production, 1 gold. This was very similar. It's currently broken, but again, I think it's still working. I can grab those. We have, uh, we don't have a third one. Um, not, not yet anyways, not until our next advancement, which is until the industrial era. So that's the next era and we can make another one, but you can move them. You can, you can replace them. Um, and keep in mind that their, their yields don't grow as the tile, imp the, the tile yields grow. So you do need to somewhat periodically do that.
When I selected my vampire, it looked like I could build one. I mean, that just because it's on the list doesn't mean I can. What's this now? So more generals. Engineers. You are done there. All good. Yeah, no problem. All good. It's all good. All right. I want to I want to see if we can take this these last cup. Well, maybe at least one more city. And then we can pause. Not, I think the one thing that's really tripping us up is how much, how much movement and how many turns are have been spent like navigating roadless uh, jungles. All right, so that's ours again. Three more Japanese cities to take. Yeah, that's insane, Bircher. That's insane. It's got to be on APOC mode, right? Isn't it nigh impossible to get the... Uh, Great bath on DD. Not anymore. They've recently changed it. That is a horrible general or a horrible engineer. Uh, no, I want listening post. You are next. Oh, it was on Prince? <laughs> yeah, that doesn't impress me as much then. All right, so now we can make cores and armies. We have nationalism. That'll boost the strength of our individual units. Um, I know I'm passing a promo here, but I really want to take this city and be done with it. All right, so that is ours now. can keep that city. And I think that'll give us an opportunity to put a cut in the video here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and finish off uh, Hojo, of, of course. And then move in, probably for capitals only, if I if I can get there in time. We've we've uh, we've taken over two two full sieves in about in less than forty turns. Well, not quite full, but most of two sieves in about forty turns. So we have twenty. If we want to do a sub one fifty, we'll see what happens. It's been a pretty good game, pretty fun so far. Uh, if you've been enjoying this, don't forget to stop by Twitch.tv/slash/the-game-mechanic and come join us in person on the internet. We'll see you then.